Hey, how's it going? Well, there it is. Witty here. Welcome to the first part of quite a few vlogs to come. I have been preparing for BlizzCon and uh, I've got quite a few things to show you. So I thought before I pack away, you better get to see what it is I'm going to take with me to stay. I didn't actually intend to rhyme that, but there you go. So, here we are. This is everything that's going to BlizzCon. I have been up a long time. It is currently just gone past 12. So technically, I'm leaving for BlizzCon today because that's 5 past 12 in the morning. I need to get up at 3.30 a.m. to get showered, changed, and all of that good stuff before I then drive off to the airport for a couple of hours and then stay at the airport for a few more hours and then depart for about 11 hours. Yeah, so hopefully I can sleep on the airplane after all the time I've spent doing this. So, let's get to it, shall we? I'm going to just go through my itinerary, so to speak. The ultimate packing chest list, checklist, I took that from a YouTube video, I'll try to link that if I can. But basically, let's start off with your passport, you can see your credit card. Sorry if the phone shakes a bit, not very good at holding on to it. So, passport, got ID, I'm obviously not going to show you all of that stuff. Uh, the cards, so debit cards, credit cards, your wallet to carry this stuff in, you've got your currency, so got US dollars and British pounds, you got your boarding ticket, or at least your e-ticket version of it, ESTA, because I'm going to BlizzCon, I need to go to America, I've got to uh, go through the motions, so to speak, the itinerary direction, so that's all covered, but that's basically all over here, so basically your documents that you definitely want to take along with you, uh, travel insurance documents, house key, so when you come back home you got some way to get back inside. Then we got underwear, we got socks, my jackets, so uh, I've got a few jackets here, pick those up, and more of a kind of a light coat kind of jacket. My uh, tops, so t-shirts, jogging trousers, because I am kind of a sporty type person slash lazy. I still can't bring myself to wear decent, nice trousers, so I'm just going to wear some loose jogging trousers. Um, jumpers, we got shoes. So I clean these up a little bit so they look a little bit more presentable. Try not to trash everything, including the glasses. Eek. Let's put those up there. We're a bit safer. Alrighty. So we've got jumper, uh, I got a cleaning rag and a toothbrush, just in case your shoes get dirty on the way there. You never know, so you can always give them another clean when you come back. Accessories such as sunglasses, and then of course glasses themselves, which you're going to need. Uh, at least I do. I should do if I'm going out and about. Got um, swimsuits. I don't think I'm going to go swimming, but I thought I'd take it anyway. So with that said and done, we got some nice comfortable pajamas. Bought those up recently. Very, very cushy, very nice. Uh, let's have a look. Laundry bag over here and some extra bags to put this all in because I've got to pack this all away and then I can go to sleep. Obviously after that, first of all, I'm going to try to upload this YouTube video. I don't know whether you guys are going to see it today or tomorrow, but Oh dear. Anyway, let's come back round to the next stage, and it just goes on and on, as you can see. So, I would have my phone, but I'm currently using that to record. I've got the charger inside of a bag, power bank, electricity adapter over here. You've got laptop plus the charger. So, coming up here. So, this is just a spare laptop plus its charger. You've got network cable, you've got uh, spare extra plug points, mouse, there's a mouse pad in there, some headsets to listen to without annoying other people with music if I'm in the hotel, earphones to go with my MP3 players, so we've got that going. Then we have... All right, I see. We're getting to that stage now. So there should be... Well, here's a mobile phone case as well, in case I didn't quite cover that bit. But somewhere along here, I should have airplane headphone adapters. 
I just need to find out where those bad boys are. I would think they're down here, and they are. So <laughs> you can see how much space this is taking. Okay, right, are you still with me? If you are, make sure to thumbs up the video because you're five minutes away through. So thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoy this kind of vlog content, feel free to just note down in the comment section how OCD I am. I am incredibly OCD and I like to prepare. So yes, this is probably over preparing, but better to be safe than sorry. And needless to say, it's taken me so damn long. I'm only a couple of ways from my, well, from getting to sleep and then getting prepared for the flight. Anyway, so we got the adapters. So this will help you in case the airplane don't give you them. You can plug your headphones into those. So you definitely know you've got ones that work, or at least should do. Then we've got the Blizzard Authenticator, in case I need to log in when I'm over there. I have no idea exactly what it is I'm doing at BlizzCon, other than just enjoying it. So the vlog thing is definitely going to be a thing, because I'll try to take some camera shots where it's not prohibited. And for the most part, just give you some sort of webcam style, obviously recording myself with a camera. Um, just sort of you and me. Just have a little discussion about what happened at BlizzCon and my thoughts and opinions. And if you're up for that, then stay tuned, subscribe to the channel, because there's more of that coming. So, uh, we've got Allen key. <laughs> I don't know what I'm using that for. We've got a um, mini screwdriver kit inside of this. It's actually kind of a little cool thing. It's hard to open with one hand, but I'm man enough to do it. So inside you've got little different screwdriver pieces. That will obviously go in the suitcase, won't go in the hand luggage, because there's certain things you can take with you, hand luggage and suitcase wise. Now, moving on, we've got torch, just a handy thing to have. Ice packs, I think I'll probably only get a refrigerator, so I don't know how I'm going to use them, but I don't know, I've got them. Measuring tape, can't go too far wrong with that. Now, we move over to the toiletry bag, which has got some cotton swabs in it. There's going to be things like a uh, tooth. Where's the tooth? Oh, it's over here. I see. So, got you got your... Uh, I didn't need the charger for my uh, electric toothbrush because it normally lasts quite a long time. And I've charged it up, so it should be good. So, electric toothbrush, toothpaste. We have a um, tongue scraper. That's a must. If you don't use a tongue scraper, you really should. Floss plus sticks. Mirror. The, this thing's basically a mirror. It's like a really old shabby thing, but it's the smallest one I've got. And so I don't want a big lunging thing. You heard me. Yeah, you heard. All right. So we've got one jar that looks suspicious, but it is actually just essentially moisturizing cream for my face or whatnot. But it feels a bit dry. Uh, what else? I've got to keep tabs. I've wrote down so much. Written down. All right. So without... We did the jar. Have I moved on to the towel? Not yet, because we got Savlon. That's just a nice medical thing to have in case you get a cut or an injury. I've got some spot cream. Don't think I really need it, but just in case, you never know. It has been quite stressful, and I've been obviously up quite late a lot of nights, so not getting the best skincare. We got a nail brush, because why not? That's probably good for cleaning your clothes a little bit in case they get a bit dirty in some way. Uh, we've got spare toothbrush head, there's some more floss sticks, then we're going to move over to the towel, plus some face cloths, there's some deodorant over here, oh yes, I've got shaver, so I don't know if I mentioned that, but we've got that going down, so that's shaver, nose trimmer, I don't really need a nose trimmer, I mean I don't need to nose trim that often, <laughs> but I don't know, I've taken it with me anyway. So quite small. So we have after that sun cream. Somewhere around here is sun cream. Ah, oh, I do have it somewhere. Oh, here we go. All right, sorry about that. So right, we've got sun cream. We've got eye drops, eye bath, lip balm, and hand sanitizer. I'll be taking these two things with me to Blizzcon, and some throat and sort of chest soothing menthol sweets just in case some sugar-free chewing gum ibuprofen and migraine again i've got no problems but with the lack of sleep i'm going to get i might have a headache we've got stuff for your stomach in case you get ill i've never really taken this stuff before but 
there's the salts. It's just, I don't know, recommended stuff. You're going abroad, so you could get into trouble. We've got first aid kit. We have tissues, water bottle, a better one to take around BlizzCon, but it's got to be empty. And this is an expendable one, so when I go to the airport, I can just get rid of it if need be. Uh, ideally, I shouldn't have to, and they have water fountains, but just to be safe, because I don't know, it's been a long time. Uh, about 15 plus years since I've flown. So this is the first time doing it alone as well. And I'm going to America, so it's a bit of a whammy. We've got some fruit and nut mix inside of there. So that's just trail mix, easy stuff to eat, lots of calories to keep yourself filled. Um, I don't know whether I can take that through with me or not. I have no idea. Again, for the tea, we've got pens, pencils, highlighter, notepad, eraser, pen, era uh, pen sharpener. This is actually really soft. It's an eye mask and there's some ear pads. So that's pretty handy. So I've got that. Did I say ear pads? Ear, ear plugs, sorry. That's one thing, I'm sure. And of course, some really small playing cards. Look how small they are. But they're there nonetheless. So you can see I've got quite a lot. And moving on, just in case the flight and I need a lot of downtime. I've got two books to go through. I have no idea whether I'm even going to get close to reading even one, but I'm going through the World of Warcraft series right now. Uh, all the Warcraft books, basically, chronologically. So I'm over halfway through, and Thrall is the next one. Got a couple of alarm clocks, potentially. This is just an old mobile phone, so I know it's not my <laughs> latest thing I'm recording with it, but it's just for an alarm clock, in case this one decides to fail. So basically, it's back up. Siplog bag because I don't know why not. It's easy to put things in them and it's see-through So if you ever get stopped in security, they can just easily see what you've got Hand luggage this beautiful giant laptop bag. Very very nice And then there's the suitcase I've got to try to fit all of this in there So if none of this fits or some of this doesn't fit I can obviously lose some bits because it's a bit overkill Got name identifier, so that's going to wrap around the suitcase. And keys for the locks on the suitcase. And that is it. So, wow, that is quite a lot. I think I've covered everything. So, without further ado, thank you very much for watching. Make sure to thumbs up. And if there's anything else I've missed out, I'm sorry. But that's quite a bit. So hopefully this might have helped you as well. I don't know. If you did, again, thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and write down in the comments any other helpful, tip, uh, helpful tips? tips that you might have. Take care. All the best. Bye-bye. And there's a lovely map of World of Warcraft.